Hi, my name is JJ, aka Tech Boogie, and I'm a seascape and landscape photographer based out of San Francisco. Um, wanted to take the time today to, well, you know, welcome you to my first video. Uh, bear with me and uh, show you guys what I use in my camera bag on a regular shoot when I'm going out to shoot cityscape or time lapse of the Milky Way. Um, first, I want to show you guys my actual bag that I use. This is a Tamrac Evolution 8. Um, super handy. Basically, you know, if you're going to have one bag, this is a great bag to go with. It's massive. Um, I can have all of my camera equipment in here, three to four lenses at a time, and my laptop too, if I need that um, to go on a shoot. Um, wanted to show you guys here my actual tripod that I use. So, did a lot of research on this bad boy before deciding on this. It's called a Me Photo Road Trip Edition. Comes in nine different colors. You know, it's not cheap, but you know, it doesn't feel cheap in, in your hands. Um, it's really sturdy. You know, I've, I've been in situations where it's pretty windy and I still was able to get, you know, clean, um, steady shots with this thing. Um, kind of annoying to, you know, take apart and put together, but with how compact it is and how handy it is and how cool it looks, you know, I think it's, it's well worth it, you know. Almost every shot you've seen of mine has been shot using this tripod. Um, so I want to dive into the bag a little bit and show you guys the actual equipment that I use. So first of all, it's my camera, a Canon 70D, that's 70D. Uh, one of Canon's newer cameras, all the you know bells and whistles that the newer cameras have, like Wi-Fi and touch screen and swivel screen. Um, only thing is it's not full frame, but you know, I'm not balling, you know, I'm balling on a budget. So, you know, I'm just making it work right now. And, uh, and this camera is a freaking awesome one to make it work on. Next is my lenses. So I'll uh, take those out to show you what I'm working with here. Show me what you're working with. Cool. This camera's huge. It got so much space in it, man. Cool. Line these up for you. So uh, my number one, which is my bread and butter, do I probably shoot 90% of everything um, with this one lens? Is a Canon 17 to 55 uh, millimeter, 2.8. Um, so you know, very fast, uh, very um, very versatile lens with a pretty wide range that it covers on a crop sensor only. Um, I have my zoom lens. 70 to 300. Um, bought this a couple months ago. Probably used it honestly like eight or ten times. Um, it's a it's a good lens. It's a great lens for the price. Um, but honestly, it's not as sharp as my you know as my 17 to 55. So I don't use it that often. I got my 30 millimeter Sigmund, uh, Sigma. <laughs> uh, what I pretty much use this for is a 1.4. So if I'm if it's like pitch black outside and I'm shooting with a group of photographers and I want to get a picture of us, you know, the group. I want to do some portraits, you know, some creative portraits underneath this underneath the sky, um, under the stars or under the Milky Way. I'll use this one to do that. Okay, I want to show you guys at least kind of what accessories I'm working with too over here. Basics, um, you know, one extra battery, and I use one extra memory card. I use um, two 32 gigabyte, you know, massive memory cards, so I don't need to worry about running out of space. I really just carry an extra memory card in case I lose the first one because I've never filled up a 32 gigabyte in one shoot. Let's see, if I dig into here a little bit, I got my ND filter. I got a six stop in case I want to do super long exposures at nighttime. Uh, I got my cleaning stuff in case you know I find there's a dust you know on the on the you know dust on the lens or dust on the sensor um, that can ruin a whole freaking day you know that could ruin your time lapse ruin the perfect shot because you can't go back in that moment so always carry cleaning stuff with you. This is like one of those little rocket blaster things that shoots air out. Um, you know, into like a really compressed air into your lens. Those are really uh, helpful to have. And you know, gotta have a microfiber rag. It's not as uh, clean as it used to be, but you know, hey, uh, yeah. You wanna wash it for me? No, nah, so I, I thought not. Um, let's see, I got my camera strap. 
in case I want to walk around and just have my camera like hanging by my side if I'm, you know, out with a group of people once again. Um, this is awesome. This is a Joby Ultra Fit sling uh, strap. So instead of going over your right shoulder like normal straps, this one goes like around your shoulder and over your neck. So your camera actually ends up hanging by your side, so it's a lot easier to be hands-free. And actually your camera is more protected with this than a regular strap. Plus it looks cooler. You don't look like a freaking tourist who just hopped off the bus. Dope. Um, another really dope thing I use, actually on the regular, and I used to make fun of people for this all the time until I got one myself, was a headlamp um, with infrared light. Uh, the infrared light helps um, when you're shooting at nighttime, not like overexposing your eyes to super bright light when you're in really dark places. The infrared lets you just like see what you're doing without like having to squint your eyes or like being blind when you turn the lights off. Uh, also, I use a remote. Um, this is just a cheapo remote off Amazon. Um, you know, I honestly had to try around like maybe two or three different ones before I found this one. The other two broke. This one seems to last for me. So I'll definitely make sure I put a link to this one that I'm using. Let's see, I guess more miscellaneous things that I have here. Uh, iPhone charger, I gotta you know, have a charge with a car adapter in case I like, make sure I'm charged while I'm out there shooting. Uh, let's see, oh yeah, always, 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 always carry a gang of business cards. Uh, never know who you're gonna meet when you're out there shooting, man. Uh, let's see, and probably, <laughs> this is the last thing, and this is probably my favorite, uh, my harmonica. <laughs> So sometimes when I'm bored, you know, I'm out there shooting by myself and I'm shooting a time lapse and it's going to take 30 minutes, you know, just sitting there with nothing to do. I prefer not to be on my cell phone, like texting when I'm in nature, you know, I'll either call my mom, you know, and catch up with her or I'll play my harmonica. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Let me, let me try to play a little something for you. I don't really know what I'm doing. I just make stuff up. Let me see. Yeah, <laughs> that, that's how it usually goes down. Um, cool, well I wanted to take the time to, uh, oops, sorry. I wanted to take the time to thank you guys for watching my video. Um, if you wanna see any more, make sure you subscribe to me on YouTube or pull up my website at techboogie.com uh, for more. Uh, thanks a lot and uh, peace out, happy shooting.